the myth here is that if you change lanes really rapidly, right as you're going through a speed camera setup, that you can trick it and get out of a ticket. I think there's three ways that this myth could be true. I think either switching the lanes, moving laterally, fools the radar into giving a false reading, or switching lanes pulls you out of the camera's field of vision, or switching lanes gives the camera a blurry picture. I think it's one of those three things. Well, they all involve the same maneuvering of the car, so uh, if it works, it'll show up. So will a rapid repo give the camera a no-show? Jamie, you are good to do lane change. Roger, coming on. To test this myth, Jamie needs to be nimble, not fast. It triggered. Wow, he was way down there when they took the picture. It's going to be hard not to get caught by this thing. So that's what it's designed for. But Adam's not done yet. He thinks Jamie has yet to hit the mark. I saw the flash happen about five feet after this point. So my thinking is, to see if the lane change will work, we should have him change lanes about five feet that way. But no matter where he changed lanes, we got a ticket. Jamie's sideways shuffle kept coming up short. Got the picture. Perfect. It caught the picture just as he was swerving. Ticket? No ticket. Your swerving was beautiful, but you got a ticket. It's busted. I moved the swerve point on our little course here several times in order to try and find a sweet spot that either the radar would be confused or the camera's picture would be blurry, and that never happened. The shot was crystal clear every time of the license plate. The radar read the speed accurately every single time. This thing is totally busted. Changing lanes does not help you one bit in regards to a speed camera.